Fire officials believe the dog saw another dog through the hole, so it tried to go through, but his head is all that went through. Once in a lifetime, never saw this, uh, this scenario, but nothing surprises me in the fire service. When Captain Shane Nash arrived Wednesday morning to Blair Road, it was a sight he hadn't seen in his 25 years in the fire department, a dog with his head stuck in a dryer vent hole. My first uh, impression was, how are we going to get this dog out of the side of this house? Captain Nash says they put together a plan using a tool to breach doors and chip brick away from around the dog's head to make the hole bigger. The dog was tickled to death. It, it never barked. It never tried to bite us. Uh, it was just ready to get uh, back in the house. 